Hey guys, welcome back everyone. In this tutorial, I will show you how to optimize Windows 11 for Valorant and also for other video games you might be playing on your Windows 11 system. I'm just going to show you various steps on how to optimize your system and make it snappy, fast, and basically perform better in video games in general and also in Valorant as well. So just so you know, all of these methods that I'm going to show you are also applicable onto other video games that you might be playing. And now guys, let's get started. So first of all, in your start menu, type in storage sense. And you just want to make sure to disable storage sense as this service might actually slow down your computer. So just go ahead and turn this off. Now the next step right over here in the settings, you just want to enable game mode. So just type in game and choose game mode settings. So basically what you want to do is always have this turned on. This service helps us speed up our games a bit. So always have it on, no matter what game you're playing. All right, now you can close out, go to your start menu again and type in advanced, advanced system settings right over here. Then just make sure to go to settings right over here under performance and make sure to basically disable everything from here so that your PC runs faster. Basically all these animations of windows opening, all of these fancy blur effects and all that stuff will be turned off and your PC will be running smoother and your FPS in games will be better. So just click on adjust best performance and then click apply and we're done with this step. All right, the next step is going to be going to our mouse settings. You should actually do this the first time you install Windows because the feature I'm going to disable now and also recommend you disable it as well, it's very useless. So just go ahead and uh, go to additional mouse settings and on the point options, make sure to disable enhance points of precision. This is a useless feature that no game needs, just turn it off and your mouse will feel responsive and just overall better. And then close out from here. All right, the next step is going to be going to our settings once again, then going to apps. Now in the apps, go to startup and in the startup, basically turn off any applications that you don't need running in the background when you start your system. So it's in my case, as you can see, I have certain applications set running in the background, but if you have a lot, just turn them off and only leave the very essential stuff that you require. And this will make sure that less services and programs are running in the background while you're playing your video game. And of course, this will speed up your overall video game experience. Also guys, there is a lot of ways to optimize your system. Also, both Windows 10 and 11. So if you're interested in optimizing your system in a way that will allow you to have less input lag, more FPS, less stuttering, and overall better experience, make sure to press the like on this video and also comment in the comment section that you would like to actually see this kind of video, which will actually help you to have a better video gaming experience. So if you would like to see such videos on our channel, make sure to leave a comment and we will make some more videos on this topic. And now the last thing I'm going to show you that you might do is go to control panel, now go to hardware and sound, now go to power options and make sure to set your power plan to ultimate performance or if you don't have this ultimate performance just set it to high performance but ultimate performance is going to be the best overall power plan and just like i said if you want to see a in-depth and more additional videos on how to optimize your system for games make sure to leave a comment and i will make sure to tell you how to also enable this ultimate performance power plan apart from other various tweaks and optimizations as well. And now this is going to be it for this video guys, thank you for watching, like the video, subscribe and I will see you very soon in the next one.